and they are, <laughs> they are also a cooperative water management system of canals and wires that date back to the 9th century. And also, 84% of the Balinese follow Balinese Hinduism, 12% follow Islam, and the rest of the population follow Christianity. This is our food slide, and these are just some examples of our many exotic foods in Bali. You will see all of these foods on our menu. If you look on the very top of our menu, you will see an appetizer called Lufia, and I will now present you with it. So this is our tour itinerary. So this is our tour itinerary. Some things that you might do in Bali. <clears throat> this is the Creole kitchen where you can have breakfast. Uh, they are famous for their fruit breakfast. This is uh, the Seminyak Bali drivers. It's a beautiful place to learn about uh, Bali's culture, uh, some traditional dances, and hiking. You can take a few pictures as well. Uh, for lunch, this is Wearam Mia. Its slogan is the best fit for pork ribs in Bali. If you want more information, you can visit the website. After eating the best ribs in Bali, you can take a step out of your comfort zone and step into the ocean. <coughs> this is adventure scuba diving. <laughs> this is adventure scuba diving in Bali where you can swim with fish. After swimming with the fish, you can visit Bamboo Restaurant, a restaurant in Sevignac. On the, this right here is um, guac chard sliced beef with shrimp paste and chili. And these are fun for this. Uh, for this next itinerary, we have, itinerary we have family. Uh, for breakfast, the Fat Turtle is a perfect place to eat with your kids. They have a wide variety of breakfast food for both kids and parents. Both pictures display the fat turtles well known red velvet cupcakes. In this slide, um, it shows that after breakfast, you can take your kids to the Safari and Marine Park in Junior and view animals from the Jeep. Uh, for lunch, after watching the animals roam free, eat with the lions at Savo Lion. Where lions roam free, why eat? Uh, a very simple yet fun activity to do is visit Seminyak Beach. To finish off your day, take a bite at Waco Burger Cafe. It's the perfect place to eat with your family. They have items on the menu for everyone, including fun desserts that the kids will enjoy. Um, tips and warnings. Beware of stray dogs. They can be really annoying and aggressive sometimes. You should keep distance from all of the dogs that don't have any colors because rabies is really popular in Bali. And then horrible traffic. Really one of the only ways that you can get around Bali is on a motorcycle because of the one way, <laughs> the one way street. And you need to respect sacred areas. And whenever you go into a sacred temple, you need to be well-dressed and presented. And if you aren't well-dressed, you can go in front of the temple and you can rent clothes. Jewelry. Wear as little jewelry as possible. Because honestly, if you're wearing a lot of jewelry, the monkeys in Bali can just rip it right off of you. And a lot of jewelry makes it an open invitation to be robbed. <laughs> Monkeys, when you visit the forest, monkeys just have a habit of grabbing your items when you least expect it. This is the Hotel Leia, and um, here would be the lobby and the lounge area. And if you wanted to get gifts, there's a gift shop here in the corner. There's a pool right when you enter so you would see it. There's a spa, so if you would like to relax and chill, you could go here. There's an elevator that leads to that goes to other floors. Your rooms would be here. The ballroom is here. 
and the diner is on the other side. And if you have kids with you, there's an ice cream and bakery. And there's an arcade too for the kids to have. Um, our rooms will look like this, and the pool will look like this. The arcade is here, and it would be packed with so many games that your kids will enjoy. <laughs> the lounge area is here. This is our bibliography.